The DPP caucus has announced plans to tighten laws against so-called Chinese agents. According to a draft of the bill, Taiwanese nationals living in Taiwan can be jailed up to three years for endangering national security on behalf of any Chinese entity. The DPP plans to pass the bill in the coming legislative session, but they'll have to contend with opposition from the KMT. From Taiwan's retired generals to media moguls, China has reached out to a variety of Taiwanese nationals in its push for unification. In the upcoming legislative session, the DPP wants to tighten regulations on these so-called Chinese agents. The KMT says it has misgivings. The biggest problem is that whether an action threatens national security will be determined by the executive branch. Given that, anyone could be in danger. This bill is a blank check that gives overweening power to the executive branch. In the coming legislative session, we'll do anything it takes to block the bill. We will ask Taiwan to answer to us here at the legislative yuan. With regard to their concerns over the overreach of executive power, in the bill itself we can include specific terms that lay these qualms to rest. Before we even have a chance to discuss the bill, the KMT should not oppose it purely for the sake of opposing. The DPP caucus plans to amend Taiwan's cross-strait relations law to crack down on Chinese agents in Taiwan who endanger national security. Offenders are to be jailed up to three years or fined up to five million NT. It's a bill not without controversy, even within the DPP. It's like the case of Russia. Russia discovered that the cyber attacks it suffered did not come from within its own borders. The attacks originated from other countries. The government should spell out the terms of this law more precisely to avoid unnecessary misunderstandings on part of the public. I hope that enterprises with foreign investment will volunteer this information so that the people can have the full picture and know their rights. Ahead of the presidential elections, the government is bracing for a tidal wave of disinformation from across the strait. The ruling party is rushing to amend laws to prevent foreign forces from interfering on election day.